One local event had a day full of vendors, cosplay, and special guests for the community's enjoyment. WBBJ 7 Eyewitness News reporter Caitlin Nicholson is back from the event and live in studio to share the details. Caitlin? That's right, Garrett. Community residents put on their best costumes to celebrate the first ever West Tennessee Comic Con. Have a closer look. Costume makeup, Q&A panels, and handmade artwork were just a few things that caught your eye at the Comic-Con. Event coordinator Austin Bell was excited that there were more people than he expected who came out and supported this event at the Carl Perkins Civic Center. Everybody seems to be having a great time. Vendors are happy. All of our attendees seem to be smiling and happy. They're, they're asking if we're going to do it next year. The answer to that is yes, we're going to do it next year. Many people were spotted dressed out as their favorite comic. Some said this was their first Comic Con, while others participate in them quite often. It's really awesome getting to see so many people cosplay, so interactions with special guests. It's really awesome. Uh, for my, This is my third one. I've been to the one in Corinth, and I've been to one here before, too. It's really exciting just to meet so many people who loves the stuff I like, like with Dragon Ball Z, Marvel, DC. It brings a lot of people together. Special guests such as Stephanie Natalie, Kenny James, and Megan Hollinshed were present to sign autographs and take pictures with the public. We really design our Comic Cons to be very family friendly, and it's a place where families and friends can all come together, uh, put aside all the stresses of, of the world, um, and just all enjoy the different fandoms that we all kind of uh, get into. There were over 100 vendors. One father told us that he participated as a vendor to show his children what never giving up looks like. I'm currently a homeless author and I dedicate the book to my daughters because loving fathers who provide support and unconditional love give their daughters the gift of confidence and high self-esteem. According to Bell, Comic Con has already been booked for September of next year.